Hello everyone. Exit is here. Getting ready to continue on with the deep ocean craziness that is Subnautica. And apparently we got a high priority passenger at life pod six. That's pretty far though. Ugh. I think we're going to go ahead and continue this adventure because we got a lot to do if we want to build a home. And what I want to do today is find the sea glide. That's it. I just want the sea glide. We'll start with baby steps. And the sea glide is the first baby step. So. What I think I'm going to go ahead and do is I'm going to gather up a couple things that I need. And then we will catch you guys in a little bit when I am on the actual hunt for the sea glide part. gets better.
and we are back now. I picked up a few resources, got some food, water, and now I would like to attempt to head towards Life Pod 6. But that explosion changes things a little bit because I might not be able to go that far anymore. Whoa! The ocean is now being radiated over by the blown up ship there, so. Drop it. Get out of here. So we will see. If it starts getting angry at me, I'm gonna tuck tail and run. Oh, this is getting close. I better not even try. I gotta go 300 more meters that way. That's okay. That's okay. I had another idea. To look around. This might actually be kind of what I was looking for. Grav sphere. What's that? F. Performing sounds can. Vital signs normal. Detecting trace amounts of foreign bacteria. Continuing to monitor. Ooh. Beacon fragment. See, we're finding a few parts here and there. That's good. That's good. These aren't sea glide, though. There's a new blueprint. Whatever a beacon's good for. There's more stuff. Ooh, a trash can. Trash can would be great for the home I can't build. Okay, I'm done with those because now I'm getting minerals. Oh, it might be here. We're close. I think we're close. What's that? Beacon? Oh, there it is. There it is. Oh, yeah. We got ourselves a sea glide. Now we're the explorers of the deep. Wow. Maybe not deep, but farther. We can at least be the explorers of the far. Mobile vehicle bay? Oh! Two more of those, and then we can build the thing that allows us to build underwater vehicles. Ooh. I like that. Okay. Mm no. You know what? First things first. Make sure we're safe. Let's come over here and take a couple drinks of water. Blueprints. Alright. See he glide. Titanium. Check. Lubricant. Check. Copper wire. Check. Battery. Uncheck. Because I used them all. What does it take to build the battery? I think it was mushrooms and... We're good. Let's go build a sea glide. Maybe we maybe we got enough copper we can build the extra batteries. Oh my gosh, sea glide ahoy! I'll see you guys in just one moment when I'm back at the sh at the ship, the pod, whatever you want to call it. See you soon. Alrighty, we are back, folks. To the life pod and um, batteries. Oops. So I unplugged my headphones. Batteries. Batteries for days. I don't... Did I need to build something else? Ah, the copper wire. Oh, the copper wire. Well, I hope I have more copper down here. I, want, I needed the batteries. I needed them. Yeah. Hoo hoo. Saved by the hidden stash. Well, underwater stash. I'll take care of the message after this. We gotta build this. I'm too excited. 
the sea glide opens up so much. We're flying right along. Let's see here. Tool. Deployable. Ah, it's a deployable. You deplorable deployable. Look at that thing. The sea glide will increase your effective exploration range. For your safety, please pack supplies for long journeys and stay within five kilometers of the nearest life pod or habitat. She couldn't have summed it up better. So we're going to replace the habitat builder because we can't even build a home. What you got? This is Avery Quinn of Trading Ship Sunbeam. Aurora, do you read? Over. Yeah. I'm here. Hello. Nothing. I'm here. These old Terra ships. Yeah. They run out of engine grease. They send an SOS. You offer to help? They don't pick up. Aurora, I'm out on the far side of the system. It's going to take more than a week to reach your position. Do you still need our assistance? Over. I'll try them again tomorrow. See what the long range scan picks up in the meantime? Damn charter's gonna have us wasting our profit margin running errands for Altera. Yeah. Good old Altera. Perfect. Look at that bad boy. All right. Well, I think the best bet would be we got the sea glide. Let's take just a little. Yep, everybody can see it. Thank you. It has a light shiny. I'm so excited. It has a great little. Oh, I don't want to mess up the word. There's so many words it could be used for. Anyway, you can see the terrain. I guess topographical. Topographical. Yeah, correct me if I'm wrong. That's okay. And it's 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 just oh. We can go to the island. I think that'll be the next episode. Right now, I just want to give it a moment. Oh, we got a new thing. Okay, let's go check that out first. Well, good. We got to play with our sea glide for all of four percent battery life. Put it away. Let's save the battery. One more thing. Please be more relevant. Laser cutters. I can't even build that. It takes diamond, I think. Rub row. Huh. Would you look at that? I can't even make it anyway. Alright. That just leads right back to the exploration part of it all. One thing's for sure. We're going to need more fishes. Guys, no problem now. I will take your tooth though. I got your tooth! We'll need those later for something very important. This is that. Let's go take a look anyway. Maybe there's some, you know, maybe the laser cutter recipes over here. I don't think we needed a recipe for it before. Oh, we got so much speed now. It's so great. Ooh, we're entering a new biome, too. We might see some new stuffs. <sighs> look at that. Look at... Ooh, look at that! A sea moth fragment. That's the first ship we get. Underwater. Isn't he great? We'll look at him later. Short range scans suggest this biome supports extensive biodiversity both above and below the surface. Oh, another one. Another sea moth fragment. Nice. Thirty seconds. Uh, let's go get air first. Pretty deep. We're almost a hundred meters down there.
Alright, hopefully there's something good in here. There's a abandoned PDA. Integrating new PDA data. This one doesn't have a fancy box to give me goodies from, like the last one. Okay, I can't complain too much, much though. There were two Seamoth parts outside of this thing. And there might even be a third somewhere. What happened? Oh, biters! Oh no! Don't bite me! 30 seconds. Man, this is rough. That's okay. Wonder how far away we made it. Oxygen. I know. Oh yeah, we're getting out there. The island really isn't far, but I know it's gonna take some time to explore it, and that'll be one whole episode all its own, so. I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna head back home. But I'm going to do so along the floor of the ocean as best I can. Maybe I can find some other goodies. Wouldn't that be wonderful? What's that shininess? That is absolutely nothing. Oh! 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 Be so sorry! I didn't mean to! Please don't hurt me. Oh! Oh! 30 seconds. I can't breathe, or I'm about to not be able to breathe. I got a thing trying to eat me. I love this ocean! We're going right back down. Right. <laughs> oh, I'm asking to be eaten alive. Oh, goodness. Oh. Sea glide. I sure hope everybody enjoyed this episode. In the next one, I'll be a lot more better off. I'll have food, water built up. And we're going to go to the island, I think, and get that out of the way. So thank you, everybody, for checking out the Sea Glide and my adventure to getting it. That was a lot of fun. I really miss this game. Never want to live in this ocean, but I miss the game. Thanks, everybody. Hope you enjoy. Be sure to hit that like button. Until the next time, peace.